Hi, everybody. I want to welcome you back to Clay and May's Homestead. Uh, shout out to all my veteran buddies out there. Uh, today, I inherited some chairs, and I just wanted to share this with you guys. So, here we go. See these chairs right here? These are awesome. The way they... Well, first, let me let you look at them. Somebody uh, kind of came up with this invention, and I've never seen this one before. I've looked at a lot of uh, woodworking channels and good idea channels for the yard and stuff like that. Look here. You can put your beer here. You can put your soda pops there or whatever. So this must be the king seat. And this one over here must be the queen seat. So queen seat is going to stay empty for a while, I guess. But the king seat, let's see how this works, guys. Um, I'm going to see if I can just sit this baby. Watch out, mate. Get out of the way. See if I can sit this right. That's good for the balance. Probably not. Nope. But I will get something. Oh, here we go. Let's try sitting it right here again. I want to get it. I don't have my uh, tripod with me today. But let's see. <clears throat> Check it out. Not bad, actually. So, thinking somebody up to 300 pounds can sit up in this here, I'm assuming. Now, we'll go a little forward. But other than that, it's nice. And this is from some old wire reels. Um, let's see if I got all that in there. Oh, more than likely. So, what I'm going to also show you is, okay, now this one here doesn't have the handles on the side. So basically what they did was made a took a piece of board and nailed it from that side and that side, but I'm going to reinforce that with some screws after I paint it. And piece of board here. And this one has one, but there should be another one over here. I'm going to reinforce that with a 2 by 4 after I paint it. And uh I guess this will be for Junior. Oh, I see how it goes now. Junior sit here. Pretty much like this. For the soda. And this one just blank. See? But we're going we're gonna to hook that up. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Maybe you have some ideas uh, for your backyard. Uh, I really, really like this. And uh, next time I see some reels, I'm... I'm going to get maybe maybe two or three more. Small, large, medium, it doesn't matter. Uh, and I'm going to do the same thing. But I'm going to paint these. I'm going to sand them down, stain them, and then varnish them. If you guys got any ideas, of course, please let me know. Uh, leave a response. Don't forget to hit that like button, that subscribe button, and that bell, that notification bell. And that'll tell you every time I drop a video. Uh, let me know if you guys like this video or not. Uh, keep bringing more. Uh, this I think this is the first time I did other people's creation. Uh, I wish I knew who they were. I can uh, at least give them a shout out or something, you know. So, but uh, other than that, uh, I found these in a dumpster yesterday. So I figured they'd make some good borders. Look at this. So, if you got if you have an old tree that fell down and you don't want to use it, you can do something like this here. Uh, I was thinking about doing it all the way down, coming in. I don't know, though, because I did hostas. I had about 20 hostas over here and about the same many over there. But what happened, the deer came and ate them all up. All of them. I was in shock because... Before I bought the homestead, we had hostas, uh, and and nothing ever ate hostas except they have a thousands and thousands of ants on them. I got look here, got my buckets ready. Some of the, perennials, all perennials, I believe, is gonna go in these buckets here because, like I said, I'm, I I have to do something with this area. Uh, too many weeds, too many. Sticks there, sticks there, and you know what a weed is. The definition of a weed is any plant that you do not want 
So a tomato can be a weed because it's a plant that you do not want. So, mate, leave them alone. <laughs> Come on, girl. All righty, America. I just wanted to share that with you. So wherever you are, peace, love, and soul. This is Clay from the hood to the woods. Have a nice day, guys. And um, I wish you peace.